Welcome to Room 6, the channel dedicated to local music and the people that make it, including me. I'm Josh, and today I've been asked to review Le Wolf and the Bear, the new EP by the Lisa Mack Band. This trio actually features Lisa Mack and Jules Manning, two former Room 6 guests, along with drummer Cristobal Silvis. I've reviewed their live performances in the past, so I'm interested to see what a trip to the studio brings. And trust me, knowing those two former Room 6 guests, like I do, this one's gonna get weird. This video is brought to you by Potato Parcel. Yes, you heard that right. We'll hear more about them later. For now, let's get on to today's video. Remember way back in the intro when I said, this one is gonna get weird? This one's gonna get weird. Welp. From the very first track intro, Lisa and the boys have definitely served up some strange on this EP. Not quite a song, this track features some meandering piano while an indistinct conversation takes place in the background. It's a short, but interesting introduction to what we can expect from the rest of this album. The first actual song of the EP, Dark and Cold, is next. At first, this one seems like a straight-ahead blues song. Jules's bass line and Cristobal's backbeat, however, bring a little funk to the party. Lisa's vocals ring out strong and clear over her guitar, and the song has just enough complexity to be interesting and really highlights lyrics like you sleep so soundly and so warm, knowing that evil hasn't reached its final form. Breathe in and out like nothing alarms you, just snoring on like nothing can harm you. Changing things up a little, Words is the next track on the album. Giving some R&B vibes with a funk background, this one is mellower but somehow more purposeful. Lisa provides some noodling guitar licks that almost make it sound like the song was written in the studio in the moment, which works perfectly to underscore Lisa's passionate and emotional lyrics like, Maybe you'll come home for Christmas. Maybe I'll be on your wish list. Maybe we'll forget about we and our memories. They will sleep with the fishes. Maybe I'll learn to keep some form of vulnerability. Maybe we'll reap the future that I'm trying to see. And now, a word from our sponsors. Thanks, Josh, from the past. You know what I love? Surprise gifts. You know what I really love? Gifts that are clever, unexpected, and most of all, edible. But what the heck? Let's throw someone's face on it while we're at it. Potato Parcel is a service that allows you to send anyone a personalized message on a potato. Thinking of sending a birthday? Congrats, get well soon card? This is a quirky and hilarious alternative to the traditional card. Your friends, family, and others will get a kick out of it. Just for watching this video, and for a limited time only, you can use my affiliate link down in the description to get 10% off your order by entering the coupon code TAKE10 at checkout. Plus, you'll be helping out the channel. Thanks to Potato Parcel for being a sponsor, and let's get back to today's show. Slightly mimicking the first track, Interlude is up next. While the first track featured piano and a conversation we couldn't quite hear, this one is basically a rambling voicemail left by Jules for Lisa about a song idea. With a wandering bass line in the background, this is a humorous look at the beginning of the songwriting process between these two. Finishing things up is Lover, the longest track on the album. Aside from being the longest track, this one also has the most polish and was a great choice to wrap up this musical journey and insight into the band. Opening with some smooth rapping by Jules, the song blossoms into a sultry crooner, heavily blending the blues and funk influences this band thrives on. Lisa's vocals soar, dive, and swoop around the main thread of the tune in a way that just makes the listener bob their head along to lyrics like, I don't want to think, I don't want to know, that such a perfect love exists and I let it go. Your eyes dance to my heartbeat, my hips sway to yours. It's the most beautifulest thing in the whole wide world, to love you from here to Mars. Overall, The Wolf and the Bear by the Lisa Mack Band is a quick little peek inside what makes them tick. It's a fun but short ride through their personalities, and I hope we get a full album soon. 
Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed, and I hope that you'll click the link down in the description to get your own copy of La Wolf and the Bear by the Lisa Mac Band. It's a fun, quirky little thing, but they are so talented that a full album has only got to be even better. Um, what else? Oh yeah, if you want to see more videos like this, please click up here. If you'd like to subscribe, click up there. You know the drill. Please ring the bell. And if you want to hear my own music, click over there. Remember to be amazing, and we'll see you next time on Room 6.